A great place to take kids is Discovery Cube, a science museum located in the northern part of San Fernando Valley in Somar. Interactive exhibits along with events and presentations look to inspire kids using science, engineering, and technology. There are different approaches towards teaching children valuable skills. Discovery Play is one example, allowing children to learn about the world and how it works, giving children a chance to experiment and see what happens and why. The mission of Discovery Cube is to encourage kids' interest in science-based learning through exhibits that inspire and educate. Geared towards younger children from 4 to 10 years old with educational activities and hands-on presentations. There are a number of permanent exhibitions at the museum with plenty of open space even when it's busy. Kids are encouraged to explore weather patterns, understand earthquakes, learn how they can be more energy efficient, mostly with hands-on exhibits. The climbing wall gets kids moving to the top of the mountain using handholds that light up the pathway to the top with this kinetic athletic activity. The Planetary Research Station is a planetarium exhibit for kids to learn about the Earth, the Sun, astronomy, and science, learning about the weather on Earth or journey to a distant moon. Race to Zero Waste is an interactive environmental game where kids learn to sort, recycle, and divert waste. Kids seem to enjoy the physical nature of this exhibit, learning how to recycle and protecting the environment at the same time. Displays explain how to eliminate waste with an interactive race that sorts recyclable from trash with the first one to zero wins. The physics lab uses a chairlift to demonstrate to kids how to pull their own weight. Using a simple machine made of pulleys shows how to make a job much easier. Three different chairs using different weight ratios from easy to more difficult to demonstrate the simple science of mechanics. The chairlift seems to be one of the favorites with kids proud to be able to lift themselves up. The Aquavator is a water-themed animated experience it shows kid how the aquifer works, allowing them to learn more and about how to protect our groundwater. This part of the aquifer contains fractured rock, which holds lots of groundwater in between the spaces. You know, aquifers aren't unusual. Aquifers are the only places where groundwater can flow into the ocean. Kids can see the aquifer in the water and the aquifers are the only ones that are the Discovery Market is an interactive shopping game using touch screens to teach kids about healthy and eco-friendly shopping choices. Using a scanner, kids can choose what items to shop for. There are plenty of other activities, such as the home inspection area, where kids use an iPad to learn about energy efficiency. Using the tablet, and walking around the house looking for ways to save energy and water. On the second floor, there is an open area where exhibits and interactive activities, including the science of hockey, and an area for traveling exhibits. Discovery Cube also offers the Discovery STEM Club on Saturdays, and during the summer, LA summer camps with fun hands-on science experiments and group activities for kids from K to fifth grade. Some of the science concepts might be above some children's understanding, but they still enjoy the hands-on nature of these activities. The use of technology geared specifically to children is above what other museums in the area offer. The Discovery Cube LA is a great way to spend the day with the kids. It's like a version of the California Science Center, but with a much younger focus. Kids seem to love it, and that's the whole point. A good family experience.